Hey, it's Dexter here. I'm going to show you the new Newsman version 6 user interface. This is how it looks out of the box. I'll adjust these uh, windows a little bit so you can see better. Uh, the, got the tabs across the bottom here. We got this pinning feature where you can pin a, a tab and make it auto hide. Uh, let's see what else. We can uh, move the tabs around on this bottom pane just by clicking and dragging them around to change the order. We can close tabs and then reopening them under the view menu just like we always could. Let's see what else. You can tear off thumb, the lower tab and move it wherever you want, the lower pane, and uh, resize it and uh, access all of the elements you can drag it anywhere in the screen. If you have a second monitor, you can drag it off onto another monitor. These little crosshairs show you the positioning of where to, to put it in the window. We've also got different uh, uh, styles you can choose. Uh, themes, I guess they're called. Under, uh, where is it? Under application look. You can get an XP theme or Office 2003. We'll do it Office 2007 change the color, try the aqua. Um, all right, I just switched it back to the black. This is the default theme here. You can also change your key mappings. If you have a key sequence you'd like for certain commands, you can go under Customize and go under uh, Keyboard. And then uh, you can look at all the different things that you can customize. Uh, we're going to do... Um, and that's all you got there. The uh, add groups. Let's let's make Alt F3 open up add groups. So just click here, put Alt F3, then click the assign button. There it is. And there it is. Then you hit Alt F3. Boom. There it is. That's all I'm going to show you for now. Catch you guys later.